Welcome back to Top 5 Water Repairs. On today's topic, I'm going to tell you guys exactly what's going to happen if you don't fix that engine misfire. If you have a misfire caused by lack of spark, caused by bad spark plug, bad ignition coil, or you have an engine misfire caused by low compression, I'm going to tell you guys exactly what's going to happen. Since this engine misfire is caused by lack of spark and low compression, that means the fuel system is still functioning and that means the fuel ejector is still spraying fuel. When the fuel ejector is still spraying fuel, raw fuel is getting dumped straight into the exhaust simply because it is not getting burned in the combustion chamber. The first component that's going to fail is going to be the oxygen sensor. When raw fuel is getting dumped into the exhaust system, the raw fuel is going to contaminate the oxygen sensor and it's going to cause the upstream and downstream oxygen sensor to prematurely fail and this will trigger the check engine light. You may notice you'll start to get oxygen sensor related codes. If you wait too long to fix that engine misfire, again, this will destroy your oxygen sensor and it's going to become a pretty expensive replacement since oxygen sensor uh, parts are not that cheap. If too much raw fuel get dumped into your exhaust system caused by maybe a stuck open fuel injector or just lack of spark or low compression, this will cause damage to your catalytic converter. When too much raw fuel gets into the catalytic converter, all that raw fuel is going to get heated up in the catalytic converter and this will cause the catalytic converter to glow red. When it starts to glow red, all that material inside the catalytic converter will start to prematurely fail, again causing that catalytic converter to fail and it's going to become a very expensive repair. The next problem is maybe not really a big problem, you're just going to have very poor gas mileage. For example, let's just say before you're getting 22 miles per gallon and now maybe you might only get maybe about 16 miles per gallon. I hope you found this video useful. As always, thank you for watching and subscribe to Top 5 Auto Repairs.